there's like two layers of bacon here, plenty of lettuce uh, and tomatoes. There's mayo on grilled bread. How do you like your burger so far? It's pretty good. What'd you get? I got the ghost. What was it? The ghost burgers? They had. I was ordered in by the green apple ghost pepper jelly. And I was like, okay, I have to try this. I was a little worried that it was too spicy, but it's not too spicy. It's just a lingering spiciness. But it's been pretty good. What's the burger patty? It's the cashew quinoa burger patty. How is it? It's alright. I think I like it better than a regular burger patty. Nice! Bye bye. What'd you get? Mm. Again. <laughs> I like to friends. <laughs> Do you like it? <laughs> it's okay? What patty did you get? Just a classic. Classic? <laughs> I'm not a fan of uh, the impossible. Patties, no, oh. The out patties, but they had a the out patty. What about the mm. patty? So I went with the classic. I mean, it's not terrible. Sorry. Honey, how do you like your grapes? Oh, really? <laughs> do you like them? You want to wash your grapes before you eat them? You're making them cold. How do you like them? Okay, so <laughs> my burger, or the BLT sandwich, it's good. Um, it's kind of, you know, plain and boring, but they have this on the table. It's yellow bird sauce, the jalapeno condiment made in Texas. It really elevates it and really gives it another dimension of flavor that makes it really good. So. How <laughs> how was Spiral Diner? I liked it. I would probably come back again and get the same thing. What did you get? I got. Was the hurry recorded? Oh yeah. I got the ghost burger. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> With the cashew quinoa patty. Bye bye bye. And I'm over two today. Oh for two. I liked farmers market and I didn't enjoy the Spiral. It was just. For the portion size and what they gave you, <laughs> and when you ask for a patty melt, it's supposed to have mushrooms and onions inside. It had no mushrooms or onions inside. Like, kind of, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I was a little disappointed. Yeah, Annie, did you like your grapes? She does not like her peanut butter smoothie. Can I go like this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where would you go back? I know, let me try to go back. Where would you go back? No. Would it be somewhere where we would take tourist people? No. Okay. Well, maybe. I mean, Mincha enjoyed. But see, Mincha enjoys like trying different flavors and spices and stuff. Like if if they didn't have the coast pepper jelly with it, do you think that you would have liked it? In terms of just the patty by itself and the burger? It's hard to say. It was too fun to, to disconnect it from that experience. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alrighty then. Oh, uh -oh. if I had one thing to compare it to, uh -oh. is that Burger King has set a standard. Oh, gosh. <laughs> and their Impossible Burger is a very high standard. It's sad to say, but I've, I've tried multiple sandwiches now. The Burger King Impossible Burger is ultimately better than most of the sandwiches I've had up to. So, so basically, we have to compare the different ways that people would compare an Impossible Burger. So till the day I find a better burger than Burger King's, I look forward to it. <laughs> <laughs>